The RTS 2000 is a state-of-the-art radar test set developed by the Telephonics Corporation to provide comprehensive intermediate level testing of the APPS-143 Pulse Compression Airborne Sea Surveillance Radar. The APPS-143 can be quickly and easily tested and maintained by the RTS-2000 test set. The APPS-143 is used on a multitude of fixed wing and helicopter aircraft for marine surveillance missions all over the world. The RTS-2000 test set allows the user to easily accomplish intermediate level maintenance and calibration of the APPS-143 radar. The test set unit incorporates modern VXI or VME instrumentation bus technology, which minimizes the need for standalone laboratory test equipment, such as RF power meters, oscilloscopes, and data collection equipment. The RTS-2000 also incorporates a VME computer workstation-based radar test target generator. This test target generator can produce customized flexible scenarios of simulated radar test targets, noise, and weather. All functions of the test set are orchestrated by easy-to-use yet comprehensive menu-driven software to enable a technician with minimal training to successfully perform intermediate level maintenance or routine calibration of the APPS-143 radar. The test set contains embedded permanent APPS-143 receiver transmitter and signal processor assemblies, which are specially modified for their test set roles. The RTS-2000 also contains a comprehensive electrical interface simulation, which replaces the APPS-143 antenna group, as well as a large screen radar display, so that these elements of the radar need not be present when other portions of the APPS-143 are being tested. The RTS-2000 can be used to test a complete radar or any one or combination of its line replaceable units. In addition, the test set functions as a radar operator training aid. And with the addition of a rooftop antenna kit, the test set can be used as a fully configured shore surveillance radar. Let's spend a few moments with the RTS-2000 so we can demonstrate just a few of its many capabilities. This menu allows the operator to initialize the internal network communications between the VXI computer and the VME computer workstation test target generator whenever required, or to run an entire acceptance or calibration test on the radar. Selecting trainer radar allows the operator to control a radar connected to the test set, much as a radar operator on an aircraft would do, or an optional rooftop antenna kit can be provided with the test set to allow it to be operated as a shore surveillance radar for training purposes. Selection of self-test allows the operator to perform a check of the RTS-2000 at any time. Selection of simulator control allows an experienced operator to run customized test sequences on the APPS-143 radar. This selection also allows the experienced user to generate custom simulated radar test target sequences which go beyond the standard scenarios embedded in the test set software. The RTS-2000 configuration menu provides flexibility in selecting which elements of the radar are to be used with the test set. Let's see how the RTS-2000 can be used to test an APPS-143 antenna group. A simple login procedure provides a permanent record for the test technician responsible for the test and allows only the more knowledgeable user access to modifiable test sequences. A diagram of the required test setup can be printed out, minimizing the need to refer to service manuals. A menu of the test parameters guides the user at all times. Test results are available on screen or via a printed hard copy. A pass-fail summary printout is also available as a permanent record. The RTS-2000 can also be used to quickly and accurately measure key parameters of the APPS-143's receiver transmitter, including peak output power.
Again, test results are available on screen, and a permanent test record can be easily printed out on the RTS 2000's laser printer. As previously mentioned, the test set also contains a sophisticated radar test target generator, which can be used to test the tracking features of the APS-143, as well as providing a comprehensive end-to-end -end test of the radar from RF to digital. Here, we have set up five simulated radar targets with a target moving at 100 knots. Note that the radar screen also displays simulated radar noise. Individual or multiple targets may be tracked by the APS 143's tracker function. Since the APS-143 can also function as a weather radar, we have also included the ability to generate simulated geometric weather patterns. Aircraft radar operators can experience realistic training scenarios using the built-in test target generator we have just seen in operation together with the RTS-2000's radar control screen. The RTS-2000 approximates what the operator will have available in the aircraft. Thus, the test set can be readily used as a radar operator training aid, saving valuable actual flight time. The test set can also be easily outfitted with a simple conversion kit, which will allow it to operate with a Telephonics high-gain, high-resolution rooftop antenna, making the RTS-2000 radar test set a highly effective shore surveillance radar. To ensure that the RTS-2000 is always working at peak capacity, a series of internal tests are run each time the test set is activated. Any potential test set problems are immediately highlighted, making for ease of maintenance of the test set itself. Well, we have just scratched the surface demonstrating a few of the many capabilities of the RTS-2000 APS-143 radar test set. With this test set, users of the APS-143 radar can ensure continuously available comprehensive on-site maintenance and calibration, guaranteeing enhanced mission time with minimal operator training. For more information about the RTS-2000 or the APS-143 family of radar products, please contact Telephonics Command Systems Business Development at 815 Broad Hollow Road, Farmingdale, New York, 11735. Telephone 516-755-7369 or fax 516-755-7644.